Right then, a bit of a development for everyone here. Um, this is my uh, latest growth in the business. Um, I am here at our unit. We have just taken it over. There's an awful lot of um, there's an awful lot of jobs that I want to do to it, but um, and I'm going to make it a really, really nice place to be, a really, really nice place to come and work. So uh, let me show you around. So you're very welcome uh, to my unit. You flick on the lights here. We have done a surprisingly uh, a lot of cleaning. Uh, the people that were in here before, um, had, there was loads of sawdust down here and stuff, and it was just like a. A bit messy there's loads of kind of cobwebs and that all up here and uh, we use the water fed pole for cleaning down that shuttering we uh, swept down all the walls kind of hoovered them all down and stuff like that um yeah so this is it uh 80 uh, square meters um of a unit um and this is going to be absolutely uh fab this is going to make uh, absolutely massive difference uh to the business uh, going forward and uh, I am so excited about this. Um, like for years and years, I've worked out of uh, sheds and um, like machines here, there and everywhere and stuff like that. But now finally, everything is gonna be in its right place uh, exactly how I want it. So here, a bit of a tour. Uh, here we are on the industrial estate. There is an alarm going in uh, this week. Uh, so here is first thing is course. Uh, the bathroom, so like for an industrial unit, I have to clean it up a bit, but like for an industrial unit, it's not the worst, uh, it's not the worst thing in the world. Um, this office here, um, the red isn't going to stay, um, and it's cash to be honest. Uh, I'm actually down here painting today, so I've got a bit of scrubs on and stuff. Yeah, so we've been hoovering, uh, that, that office is really, really cash now to be honest. Um, it's, uh, I don't know what the person uh, was doing beforehand. Um, so all this is gonna come down. I'm gonna make this really nice. That's coming down, that roof is being changed. Um, and what we're gonna do is that, that office isn't quite big enough because um, I want it as like a really cool place to come and uh, to, uh, you know, do invoices, uh, do accounts, organize work for the following days. Uh, do quotes and all that sort of stuff for customers and you know have it as a, a nice place to come just to you know if I'm tipping at the weekend or something like that that it's a bit of a man cave as well so what I'm gonna do is uh, that office like I don't want it to kind of encroach too much into the, the space um, but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna um, elongate out the, the stud uh, to this wall here so that it's another sort of like meter and a bit longer than than what it is now. Um, uh, gonna take down that wood, um, gonna uh, insulate it, uh, do a better stud wall, do a better roof so that we can have storage up on the roof on top there. Uh, that's gonna be the bee's knees. Um, I'm just gonna make a really, really nice office. Um, uh, Build a nice desk, um, filing cabinet in there, Wi-Fi, uh, possibly a TV, and just make a really, really nice proper office. It's something that I've wanted for flipping years and years is to have a nice office. Um, so that's gonna kind of take up that room to here. Um, my water uh, is gonna have to uh, come out of the bathroom, gonna tee off the mains there, and I'm gonna put a new 4040 system I don't know whether to do an IBC there, so they've got water ready kind of all the time, or um, I'm gonna get a float, um, uh, like an autofill, auto off uh, float solenoid kit, so that I can leave the van here and maybe just pull, what I normally do is pull the van in, and the van comes to like about there, and, um, and then just kind of uh, leave it overnight, or if I'm in doing invoicing, the 4040 uh, can fill it and stuff like that. Um, and then uh, all the rest of this area, so it's gonna be taken up to here, so I'm imagining like uh, some of my carpet cleaning machines and stuff like that over there. Um, some other, like the gutter vac and all that sort of system there. Um, maybe uh, if I want to work on my car at the weekend, uh, the TT, 
uh, maybe I might bring that down and slot this in here so that I have a nice place to come and work. Um, and then over on this side, I was thinking of doing like a worktop kind of workbench area with shelving on top where we can put all our chemicals, supplies, um, window cleaning, spare fittings, uh, a vice on there and stuff like that uh, underneath storage. Um, and then if you can see like from the width of the van and that there, like I, I don't want to cramp it up. So maybe on this wall here, I might put like um, hangers for ladders and steps and stuff like that. So it's gonna, it's 80 square meters, but by the time the office is made that little bit bigger and the office is made nice, and by the time that the machines kind of, all this is the previous owner and it's gonna go away, uh, the previous leasee, I should say, um, uh, machines kind of roll uh, along there. Maybe, like I said at the weekend, maybe the car sideways there while I um, tip and do bits on it. Maybe nothing against that back wall. Um, there might be some sort of storage in time and then that there. Uh, yeah, so um, that is, uh, that's the, the latest uh, development, uh, the new thing that's going on. Um, the project for uh, this week and kind of using the coronavirus time as like a, um, as a time, like in March when, uh, like in March, a lot of my uh, contracts have started again. A lot of you know factories and stuff have been in contact, wanting to start up their um, their cleaning again in March. Uh, loads of bookings coming in for that. So February is kind of my month for getting a lot of this stuff done. Um, and uh, so uh, I have a uh, paint there. So we are going to going to be uh, painting all of this white section white again. And uh, I also have flooring paint. So we are also gonna paint the floor in a really nice light gray. Um, it was painted before, but that was probably many years ago. Um, but it'll be a really nice place uh, once it's painted. So I suppose it just takes a bit of vision and a bit of patience and a bit of hard work. I, I wanna put a proper roof on top of the office so that I can store any kind of like long-term storage things there um, to make use of that space up there. Uh, so, but you know, your, anything that you don't use for months at a time can definitely uh, go on top of there and maybe do a bit of a handrail around so I can physically get up there properly and everything is safe. Uh, yeah, like I said, and it'll be alarmed, monitored, and um, with the paint on the walls, paint on the floors, uh, it's going to be a really, really nice place to be. Um, uh, surprisingly... Um, the uh, lease and the rates aren't at, actually too bad. Uh, it's not too bad whatsoever. Um, so I suppose for me, I've always wanted, and I think it helps with the professionalism. Sometimes you need to take that little bit of a jump sometimes, and it adds to your professionalism when you're talking to customers, it's that you have a unit, it's that that's your unit address. It all just kind of helps with your marketing as well, like, and I'll put it up on Facebook when it's the finished product. Um, it helps you in your mindset as well as a business owner when you're in a really nice office doing stuff um, because in in Ireland there is so much kind of like irregular work uh, calls that come in especially for carpets and upholstery so there there is a lot of organizing to do um, yeah so it's uh, I am gonna have to get uh, painting now uh, it's time to kind of to get on with this day um, hopefully it'll all turn out class at the end and it'll be a really nice unit to come for business and uh, to a certain extent for pleasure as well that it'll be a nice uh, place to come and uh, tinker and stuff on my car so right that is enough talking i am going to bring the van in and i am going to do a bit of paint Right then, I'd say that's as boring as watching paint dry. So here, uh, I'll, I'm brushing it because it's the, the wall is just so rough. Just, uh, I want to do a good job. So right, maybe I'll do a video in a bit. See you guys. Well, one pot of paint later, 
and it's looking a lot brighter. Do-do.